What is it about this confounding game that keeps us coming back for more? Is it the freedom of the open air? The pure seven iron strikes from tightly mown fairways? Or the sound of the ball hitting the bottom of the cup? The course is our canvas on which to paint our own path, not with the stroke of a brush, but that of a club. As the great Gary Player once said, the more I practice, the luckier I get. It is long evenings spent at the range where we can really dedicate ourselves to achieving perfection. It is here where adjustments are honed, where techniques are perfected. But it's not just about the range, it's about what happens next. As you step onto the course, those changes come to life. The subtle shift in stance, the newfound rhythm, they become your companions on the fairway. But it seems golf is more than just a technique. It's a test of character, a battle of wills against the unpredictable. From the thrill of a perfectly struck shot to the agony of a drop ball, unplayable lies and anger aplenty. Every setback a lesson, every triumph a testament to resilience. It's in these moments of struggle that we find our true strength, our determination to persevere. For in this pursuit of excellence, there are no shortcuts, no easy victories. So why do we keep coming back? Because deep down, we know that inside every golfer lies the potential for greatness. Golf is gratifying, exasperating, humbling and beautiful. A game played on grass, but mastered between the ears. This is more than just a game. It's a passion, a journey and a promise of endless possibility.